Green is great. Green is good. Green is the plate where we eating good. Green is grass. Green is cash. Green is life. Green is growth. But most of all, green is go. So with that being said, let's chop it up and let's get this green up. Yeah, right. yeah, for sure. Man, this is Jay Green, Green Room TV, Jay's Green Room, and we sitting down with the one, the only, yours truly, you know what I'm saying, Mr. Draped Up Drip Dye, uh. Mr. That's My Speed, yeah. you know what I'm saying, Mr. Flood the Rolly, yeah. you know what I'm saying, Fifth That's Ward it, Zone, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, Houston, Texas artist, D-Bondo. Already, bro. Yeah, yeah. I know a lot of people say D-Bando. Yeah. But it's D-Bando. Yeah, you got it right, man. Yeah, I, I be paying attention. I yeah, do my yeah. research. I, yeah. I, I, don't, I don't bring you to the green room if, 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 I don't, if I don't do my good good green eye on you. You know what uh, I'm saying? I like to see what's up with you. I like uh, to. I really appreciate you getting it right, too, boy. I appreciate you. Break them down, because I've seen interviews before. I've seen other things. And I've met people throughout Houston, you know what I'm saying, that may say they might know you where you're from. Yeah. <clears throat> but given the breakdown, why it's pronounced Bando? Is it a bando? It's really pronounced Obando. It's Colombian. Okay, okay. But you know what I'm saying? Obando is the American way to say it. Yeah. Obando is my last name. So that's where the D Bando come from. Right. Initial my first name and then Obando just take the Bando from there. So there ain't no trap shit, none of that yeah, shit. Yeah, I've been yeah. Bando since I was born. Yeah, 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 yeah. You yeah. know what I'm saying? That's live though. That's 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 a that's a name with that ring to it. It's, yeah, yeah, yeah. we made to it. So you are you born in Colombia? Your family from Colombia? Yeah, my dad is. Your father? Okay. Yeah. All right. So you grew up with your father or not? Nah, nah. I grew up with my mom. I used to go there on the weekends. I went to Colombia one time when I was little. Yeah. You know what I'm, saying? I'm trying to go back now. You hear any? You got any Spanish? You picked up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. I know a lot of Spanish, bro. Hey, what's up, man? That's. That's, I yeah. like that, man. I like that, because that... Uh, that shit, that shit, it, it helps, you know what I'm saying? Like, it just helps with the music, too. Really? Because I listen to a lot of salsa as well. Hmm. So okay. all that shit plays a role yeah, in, yeah, yeah. you know, the creativity. Yeah, that's live. I, I wouldn't have thought about the music, but uh, my parents from Jamaica. Yeah. So, you know, I, like I told you before we start recording, I used to fuck with the music, too, so I, I definitely can relate. Yeah. How it can help yeah. you, like, stretch it culturally. When you said it helps, you know what the first thing popped in my head though was. What you talking as much as it? With the ladies, man. Oh yeah, my <laughs> They too. They too, you know, they love that shit, man. You yeah. Know, being bilingual and it's some smooth shit. Yeah, you know yeah, yeah. So what's your speed? More of American female or Spanish Latina female? Shit, I like beautiful women, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? Black is beautiful. Right. Shit, Hispanic is beautiful shit. They got some white fire yeah, 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 You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm it's just like shit, you look good to me, I find your check. That's my speed, that's my preference. You know? Okay. That's what I like. Mm. Okay. Alright. That my that's my speed, of course, reference to the hot, flaming hot single you got going right now. Yeah, yeah, more different. You know what I'm saying? But before we get into that, you know what I'm saying? Anybody who watch Green Room videos know that we trying to go Get your whole story from the beginning. Yeah, yeah. So we were really just vibing, chopping it up. So now I want to bring it back. I usually like to have a first question. I start with a, something I lead into. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So with this one, I'm gonna start the same way you started, Dotted Three. Yeah. With Papa Roach. Yeah. Okay. Like all right. So before we get into all the other stuff, for Houston, Texas viewers, yeah. for rap viewers, for Green Room videos, explain to us who Papa Roach is. Man, Papa Roach, man, is a, <laughs> man, I can go on and on about dude, bro. Just hard to go, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Like, you don't find too many genuine people that want to see the next man win like that, you know what I'm saying? Some people, yeah, yeah. But a dude will give up what he have for you to win. You don't find people like that, bro. For sure. You know, like me and Pop, I've been knowing Pop probably about six seven years mm -hmm. we'll cross paths i see him you know he's looking good shining right. you see me man you grind i like you know i like your music me doing what you're doing right and just like three years ago uh that's when he built the restaurant and man, i was coming through there getting food i'm like damn nigga, what's up boy ain't seen you. <laughs> and he like yeah man it's my restaurant i need your shit i'm like damn yeah. that's what's up yeah he like man i've been here to see you with nothing 
shit going crazy. Like I'm like, yeah, bro, you know what I'm saying? Just push. He like, man, who who helping you? Like, you know that who down with you? I like shit, just me and my little niggas, you know what I'm saying? I ain't got no motherfucking money man behind me. I ain't got no gang of motherfuckers that's, you know what I'm saying, that's willing to help like that, but nigga, we making it work. We putting our money together and making it work. Boy, he like, man, come holler at me, man. Let's sit down, let's talk, man. We talk, man. He said, man, I wanna fuck with the music, my dog. I wanna I wanna put my poetry out there, man, but Nobody want to help me, you know mm. all that? So, man, we just locked in right there. And I sit in the studio probably like two, three days out the week recording them, man. I'm, I'm saying it's a beautiful thing because I'm like, damn, bro, you talented. Like, you know what I'm saying? With the you used to go to the studio bro. with him. Yeah, okay. yeah. We went to the studio together, man, and I'm recording them. We just vibing, man. It just went to something else, bro. It just went to a relationship like no other. It was like, man, let's, let's start a label, nigga. Let's... Let's do this. So I'm throwing out names. Nah, that shit whack, nigga. <laughs> I'm throwing out this. Nah, that shit whack, nigga. We got to come hard. They got to be some shit with niggas just, you know what I'm saying? Like, okay, okay, nigga, I hear you. Right. So I'm like, I just went back to my first ever CD I dropped called Can't Be Stopped. What year was that? That was like, 09. Okay, some okay. shit like that. All right. I'm not taking your track, but I'm listening. Yeah, uh, my first mixtape, Can't Be Stopped, CBS. So. I said, man, what we name my shit CBS? He like, okay, that's like new shit. I'm like, nah, nigga, can't be stopped. Yeah. Nigga said, nigga, that's it. <laughs> that's it. Man, yeah. let's run. Man, let's go get our business together. Let's get our partnership shit together. Let's go, nigga. Yeah. Boom. Nigga, we handle it. He, he showed me some shit. I ain't know. Yeah. You know, for like setting up the, 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 the proper way to have in your business. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? And paying your taxes and different shit. I ain't know no. I get my money. I get cash. You know what I'm saying? A lot but, of niggas like that. Yeah, bro, but just being around a business-minded person, genuine, want to see you win, bro, and and whatever. Like, whatever it takes, bro, let, let's do it. I'm down with you. Let's run. You know what I'm saying? And went from there. You know, I had to put him. I put him on my Purpose album first. And he, he was shocked because I didn't even tell him I was going to do yeah. it. He was like, damn, bro. Everybody seeing me and telling me, man, you don't want no album. And, and he was like, damn, bro, like. Real, you know what I'm saying? But recipe Papa Roach, man. Yeah, definitely. Papa Roach died last year, 2018. Yeah, definitely, man. Houston street business staple. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Papa Roach, okay. I I knew, kind of knew he did poetry, but I didn't know it was that serious. Yeah. So from you, Papa Roach, you would say is a poet. Yeah. Businessman. Businessman. Uh, is he originally from Houston? Yeah. Okay, originally from Houston. He a little bit older than you, though. Yeah, Papa old. Yeah, so. Forties, fifties, forty, forty. Okay, so like mentor to you, kind of. Is he from Fifth Ward? Yeah, from Fifth Ward. Too. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, and like, man. it wasn't until last year, like when he died, that I started hearing everything about him. I had heard of him before. I actually followed him on Instagram, but it was you know one of them things. Yeah. <clears throat> Would you put Pop in that category of like a Nipsey Hustle kind of person? Yeah, yeah, well, definitely, bro. But see, he was a type. He never wanted the glory for nothing. Right, like, right. He never wanted. To be seen. Right. He never wanted his name on that, you know what I'm saying? Like, even with, you know, with the CBS thing, you know, and I was telling him, like, yeah, bro, life short. I used to always tell him this. He like, man, I'm like, nah, y'all, we went to New York. I'm like, come on, Pop, man, we going to New York. Man. Nah, y'all got it, man. Y'all going to have fun, man. Yeah, what's up? Go to Los Angeles. Nah, y'all got it, bro. We going to. Florida, everywhere I'm going, you know, pushing my music. Nah, y'all got it, bro. Mm -hmm. I'm like, bro, you know, you got to enjoy yourself, man. You know what I'm saying? I know you got a lot of business going on here, the restaurant, different other stuff. But, man, you got to enjoy yourself, bro. But he was, the type, he was like that, though. You know, helping so many people and never been like, oh, I did that, I did that shit for you, nigga. That he never been like that. It was just like, I did it because I got the heart to do it. and like, You know what I'm saying? I want you to win, bro, and it's just, it's crazy. Yeah, that's real. So, how, how did how did he die? Man, he got killed. He got killed? Yeah, he Man, it's, it's too much of that shit going on. Yeah, bro. Too much of that shit going on. Yeah, he got killed, bro. Um, without talking too much detail on that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Is it something that's been solved or figured out? Or? Man, it's still ongoing. Yeah. yeah. It's still ongoing. Yeah, I feel you. That shit hurt you, though. Yeah, that shit hurt a lot because shit, he died. An hour after me being with him. 
Yeah. You know, and that just it like, still plays in my head today. Like, damn, like if I would have went down with him or did this, would I've been a target too? Mm-hmm. You know, with people watching me or you know what like, we we really don't know is like I don't I don't know I don't know him from having no enemies, bro. Right. Now you know, pop type person. Nigga. We in the club and he don't even know you. He step on your shoe. My bad, bro. Yeah. And you know what? I fucked your shit with. I'm give you a hundred dollars. You know what I'm saying? That's, That's how he is. No, mm-hmm. no matter how broke you might seem, or how, how, you know what I'm saying? Like he treat everybody equal. You know what I'm saying? Like you on his level. So uh, you don't find too many people like that. Especially dude that got money. Like nah, fuck it, man. Yeah, fuck mm-hmm. it. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, this is not too many people like that. Yeah, no. Not too many people like that. So, you see, he seemed like a good person. For somebody want to do that, it's probably along the lines of jealousy. You know what's so crazy? No yeah, matter how much, jealousy, bro. no matter how much positivity you put out in this world, bro, same thing with Nipsey, bro. Same thing. Like that's yeah. I was about to say I that can too. I help my whole neighborhood, bro. Like somebody gonna find something wrong with it. Cause they just jealous, bro. Even now, see with nothing ain't just a song I made up, bro. It's some real shit. Yeah. Like and this motherfucker that was around me that didn't want to see me with shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? And me, I'm the type I pay attention to a lot of shit. Motherfucker, like, damn, that nigga bunny quiet. They don't say nothing. Cause I'm just, uh, you know, I observe more than I talk. You know, I ain't gonna do too much talking, bro. I just pay attention to the hate. The envy, the little, little shit motherfuckers do. You hear it though? Yeah, I, 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 I'm, man, I'm very observant to a lot of shit. I just don't say nothing. So I'm motherfuckers feel like you don't know, you know. You know, say, oh, he don't know. He ain't saying that. Fuck that, I know, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah. just niggas in the neighborhood, niggas outside, niggas in the city, bro, just hating, bro. Like, for what reason? Like, it's crazy. Do you think that, do you think the hate? That's going on, not even just in this rap, but just in the street. You think, Houston wise, you think it's getting out of out of hand? This hatred, yeah, most definitely, man. Yeah, it's definitely getting out of hand, man. Like, it's to the point where it's like it's just making nigga want to just leave his hoe, bro. Like, yeah. I, I'm, I already got intention to leave it anyway. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I can it's tell just, from your music. Yeah, it's just making nigga just like fuck all that shit, bro. Let me yeah. just. Go out here, man, and, and, and do my thing, bro, because it's getting to the point. It, it, it's scary down there, you know what I'm saying? It's like, you got to watch exactly how you move. You can be feel like you cool with everybody. Be a motherfucker right on side of you. Yeah. Won't you go on or won't you, won't you have, bro? And it, it just, it's and they sick. Got, and they doing bro. no tripping about it. Yeah, like, it's sick, bro. Yeah.